Hey gang, Generic Soul back again. I am waiting on a video to, uh, I'm actually waiting on music for a video I took of the, uh, of the blizzard, and, or blizzard, call it a snowstorm, with a lot of snow, that's all it really is, and anyways, I was, uh, watching a couple of videos, I've got this on post-it note actually, I was watching, uh, Jay's video about, uh, the ten questions, that guy's hilarious, I don't care what anybody thinks. He comes up with some good good uh, topics and so forth, and here is the 10 questions he put out to the members of the YouTube pipe community or pipe world or whatever. Oh, boy, I got somebody talking to me, and I don't want to talk to them right now. How much is a gallon of milk? Well, I don't know, to be honest with you. I haven't uh, bought milk in quite a few weeks. I've been stuck on vodka and orange juice. So um, we're going to skip the first one. Uh, how much is a gallon of gas? Um, it's averaging out at about uh, 375 a gallon. That's fun stuff, you know. Um, the average pi price for 50 grams of tobacco? I don't know, quite frankly. This goes into another question. Uh, question number seven, and we'll get into that. Um, what is the local dish in your area? <clears throat> well, if anybody's qualified to answer that question, it'd be me. Uh, of course, you've got the uh, New York strip steak. Um, you've got the um, the burger, and um, let's see. Hold up, dude. I'm taping a video. Okay, um, let's see, uh, the, the burger, of course, everybody, everybody does a burger. We do a bunch of neat twists on the burgers where I work now. Um, one of them's a surf and turf burger, and it's fucking amazing. I won't tell you what's in it just yet, because <clears throat> that's not what this video is about. Uh, the, uh, how many people live in my town? I was looking at this, actually, um, before I moved here. Uh, there's like 29,000 in the, in this, uh, city, but, uh, my old town, even though I don't live there anymore, it's, um, about 500 in the winter, I think it is, and then a couple thousand in the summer. Uh, it depends, because there's a lot of tourists, it's a huge tourist area, but, uh, I don't live there, so that doesn't matter. Um, how far, uh, do I know... Yeah, do I know of any other pipe smokers in my town? Um, actually, I saw one the other day at school. I was sitting in my uh, hospitality law class, and the window was open, and there's a professor that, or instructor, because it's small, whatever. Uh, there's a there's a instructor there that uh, smokes a pipe, <clears throat> and uh, he was puffing on that thing like it was going out of style. It was a bent pipe, and I unfortunately couldn't run out there and. Uh, have a pipe with him because uh, I was in the middle of class. So one of these days I'll catch up with him. Uh, how far is away? How far away is a real tobacconist? Well, that one's about an hour and a half, roughly, give or take. Uh, I got a little closer. It was an hour forty-five. <clears throat> uh, I moved a half hour south, so you do the math. I'm not gonna. How far away do I have to get to work? Well, that was one of the main reasons for me uh, moving here. Uh, it's right around the corner, which is perfect. Um, I work for 40 hours a week there, plus full time at school. I couldn't, I couldn't drive back and forth uh, to my old hometown because um, I would probably want to smash into a tree or something. So uh, we put away with that. Um, four miles from school and about. 40 seconds from work, so that's pretty awesome. Uh, if I could smoke a pipe with a famous pipe smoker from the past, who would it be? Mm, I don't know. Probably Pipe Friend. He counts. He's famous. And a pipe smoker. He's been, a, he's been around in the past. Logic. If I lost all my pipes in a fire, how far away would I have to go to get a pipe? This is question number 10. Well, I'd only have to go out to my car because I have a Edwards pipe in the glove box. So, if the 
pipe cabinet and the uh, the car burned up miraculously somehow or another. Well, I'd be happy because I'd get a new car. But uh, I think I would have to go back to my hometown where they have corn cob pipes sitting around somewhere in storage. Um, when I first started smoking a pipe, it was a corn cob pipe, and the guy that owns the store, who was actually my boss as well, uh, he saw me smoking a corn cob pipe, and he chuckled and tried to make a stereotypical uh, joke out of it, and I just shook my head and continued doing what I was doing. So I think they've still got some corn cob pipes in storage, um, so that's technically I'd have to drive a half hour or an hour round trip. But uh, that 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 was kind of fun. Uh, Jay, if you've got more fun topics in the future that are interactive, such as this, uh, please feel free to uh, post them. And uh, till next time, don't do anything I wouldn't do, kids. Oh, and by the way, that uh, snow video, you're going to like this one. Stay tuned for that. That'll be coming up as well tonight. Till next time, don't do anything I wouldn't do. See ya.